Hey guys, Brian Parnell here. Hope you're doing well. Um, I just wanted to quickly go through a uh, product that is launching next week. I've just managed to um, get early purchase of it and um, there's loads that it can do, but for what I wanted it for, it's working really, really well. So um, I want to give you a little tip. Okay, of how to use this because everybody every man and his dog is going to be going out there getting the email addresses out of Instagram which is what this does okay and then emailing them okay but what what you want to be doing obviously you can do that but also you want to go out there and create your lookalike audiences in Facebook from these email addresses that you get OK, um, the reason for that is that you can then market to these lookalike audiences on Facebook, which is a little bit easier than doing it via email. Because as soon as you send all these emails out, um, they start going to spam. Um, I don't know, you know, if you're on my email list, if you're watching this video and you're on my email list, you might not see an email about this. Um, I've got quite a big email list and most of it just goes to spam because of how um, how strict these spam places are. So let me, I'm just going to just go through very quickly what it does. Okay, so you've got your normal training over here. Okay, then you've got premium training, then you get upsells, there's three upsells, they're all, um, I think it's got the prices on here. I have got all these, um, like if I click on it, it doesn't open anything up because I've already got them. Um, so you've got your VIP training, which I think is going to be very important for, um, probably, I, I just like, if there's a VIP training, I always like to buy that because there's always things in there that I never thought of. Then... You hit limits for things, okay? And to be able to dig into and have, you know, thousands and thousands of IP addresses that these guys are paying for on their own server, um, it's forty-seven dollars a month, which I think is a no-brainer. Once you see what it can do, you'll you'll agree. Um, then you've got your white label, and there'll be loads of people that buy this, use it for your. Um, um, for your clients and finding other stuff and all that kind of stuff. Um, so yeah, all all good. And then you obviously you go into your white label bit here. Um, if you can see, if I click on it, it doesn't open anything up because I do have it, but obviously it's early at the moment and the tool doesn't kind of work in here, um, if that makes sense. So if we just click on the training, hopefully nothing auto plays. So it's a Chrome plugin. You can extract Instagram users, okay? Then you can extract emails from those users. And this one just shows you how to put the how to put it up on your um, uh, how to pin it up into your other. Um, extensions so it's just at the top here so if I click on there you can see it says profile mate so I'm just going to go and go to a new tab I'm going to open it hopefully it will log in yep logs in logs in as me and these are all your things right so you've got training again over here all your other tools okay loads of it in here so I'll come back to dashboard so there's so you can analyze users and you can find users OK, now you can use hashtags, you can use locations. Guys, think about this, right? If you've got clients and you've got clients in, um, I don't know, Birmingham, Alabama, um, you can find, you know, just those people and get their email addresses. OK, so, you know, you can you can email them via you know the can spam act just remember you've got to you know put a little thing at the bottom to say um you know i'm emailing you through can spam blah 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 and if you you know don't want to receive any more of my emails make sure you click here um 
but you can do that and build these lists, build marketing campaigns for clients and charge that out accordingly. Okay, it's really, really good. Um, and then obviously with the hashtags, if there's, I don't know, plumbing is probably not a good one, but you know, you can put plumbing, plumber in there just to see what comes up and I'll show you these in a minute. Um, and then people who like comment on different posts from different people so they're more engaged and all that kind of stuff right so so let's just click on it a minute and have a look so um, so you've got followers following so you can go in and put people's names in um, so you've got your own account and then you can well let's just click on my own account and see what um, now I've hit so this is a little bit different because your accounts have 24,000 a day limit so in messing around with this I've already hit the 8,000 but you know you would go in there and you can click analyze your followers all right or click in there and analyze who they're also following okay so let's go back to here specific posts like so if you if there's a post that's gone viral and it's to do with your actual um, your actual niche market your clients niche industry that's a really good one okay um, if I come back to this one again and then do view any other accounts okay let's um, um, God I'm trying to think of a, a big SEO um, who I wanted to um, oh, it was just on the tip of my tongue let's Matt let's do Matt Diggity I don't even know if he's got a there he is, right? So if I click on, oh, so if I click on there, the most most of the people whom are following Matt will be, you know, will be SEOs. So from my perspective, this is a good one to to go after. So if I click on that one, um, so he's only got 192 followers. So you know, it's not going to set the world on fire. Um, obviously, you know, you can go and do all this kind of do the research and everything, and then go and find who you want to. Um, who you want to follow I would suggest that SEO is probably not a great one um, but you know it is what it is so let's uh, let's open another one a minute because I'll leave that one going um, let's do from locations right so let's um, just trying to think let's just do Birmingham UK Birmingham United Kingdom there we go so if I click on there click submit and it's just going off and it's finding people okay take a little while obviously it's got to go and you know these people have got to have um, their uh, little location thing on their phones and all that but you know look at this it, it's finding people that are in this location now it's it's got to it can't just go and do thousands and thousands at once because it will you know it will get banned so you're trying to you know make sure that you're working within limits but you just leave it now you know just leave it for a day and you know there you go so this one here um, you know, in, in two hours, it'll find those others. Okay. But if, if I just, if I download these now, um, I'm going to click don't download private users because there's no point downloading private users. Now, one in 10 people on Instagram have an email address okay so if I'm I'm just on my other screen a minute and I'm gonna take the there's, there was 33 peoples okay so I'm gonna come back over to here I'm gonna open up and then I'm gonna come over to this one 
I'm going to put in those 33 people and I click submit. So we should get, um, what's this one? This one is Matt Diggity followers. Not spelt it right, but um, click on next. So it's going off and it's finding the data. Now it's obviously it's only going to find the data of the people who have email addresses public okay but one in ten have a public email address and look that's on average you know really it's seven to seven to twenty percent you can't be specific because each blooming group so here we're already over so I, I put 33 people in and I've got four email addresses okay so that's pretty awesome so you go and find you know all these little nooks and crannies of people whom are getting followed so let's let's say um, let's go to Instagram a minute. I'm just Instagram is as you know nowhere near as good on a PC as it is uh, on the mobile. You just not got as much that you can do. So um, let's. I don't know. I'm going to put in Birmingham plumber. Um, I think that's just to follow that um, hashtag. I don't really want to follow that hashtag. Let's have a look at this. Okay, so this is actually a Birmingham UK company. Um, so that's actually pretty impressive that we found this. Okay, so if I click on KL Daniel. There you go he's got 314 followers and what can you do with that you can go and copy these people okay if you've got a plumber a plumbing um, client in Birmingham you can go and get all these followers go and find all the plumbers in Birmingham who've got followers put them all into an email address Create a little fa Facebook campaign. You can even create a lookalike, but I wouldn't create a lookalike unless you've got um, a thousand minimum a thousand in a custom audience audience before you create a custom um, before you create a lookalike. Um, but you know that's just another thing that you can do. But you can e then what, if you get all these email addresses and you're up to a thousand, you can do email campaigns for these people. Okay, it's all about driving a bit of traffic to their websites and guess what that traffic to their websites will help them rank within Google especially if you've got analytics and search console and all that set up on onto clients which you know unless you're doing anything shady there's no reason not to okay um, you can even send traffic to their business uh, their Google my business and that will also help that rank okay so, you know, the world's your oyster really with this with this tool. Um, it's not out yet. It's out next week. But I just wanted to, you know, show you what it can what it can do. Okay. Um, just really, it's a really really impressive tool. Um, let's just let's click on this again. Um, what was that? Let me. In. What was that hashtag again we looked at? Birmingham Plumber. I copy that. I just want to search from hashtag. I just want to show you the. Um, there's 131 posts. Click on submit. And then it'll go and find those those posts and who who posted, who liked, and all that kind of stuff. Okay, really, really, really powerful tool. Okay, all the best then, guys. Cheers for now.